Messiah is a savior and a conqueror. Israelites, the Bible speak of. Brother, you understand? 
God told us, the Israelites, right? God told us that all yokes of iron will happen to us. God told us that what? We were going to slavery with cargo slave ship. You understand? God said these things that happened to the children of Israel will be to them for his sign. So that's why we out here showing our people that we're not blacks. We're not green alien. We are the children of Israel. Just say the Lord. It's time right right for us to wake up and come back to our nationality. Time for us to come out of these Christian churches because they are not teaching us anything. They are not teaching us who we are. They're not teaching us what we need to, up, to um, get rid of what poverty, to get rid of the I, um, murder rates that happen, the homosexuality, the prostitution. They're not teaching us these things. That's why we have to go back to the world. Because read Jeremiah chapter 6 or 16. We always have to go back to the days of old. Back to the days of old. This is the days that will teach us how to be men, how to be women. Yes, young brother, you are king, you are prince. Come, let me show you all your prince about the Bible. You understand? We are the children of God. Listen, they're not teaching us how to alleviate problems. You understand? Read for me. The book of Jeremiah, chapter 6, verse 16. Read. God fear the Lord. Read. Stand ye in your way. He says, stand ye in your way. So the most I always tell in the children, stand ye, read. And see. And what? And see. He said, look, consider. But we not consider. Look at our people today. Look at our people today. They are wayward. They are wayward. They don't have no guidance. They're not teaching them moral standards. They're not teaching them how to deal with people anymore. You understand? So he said, look and stand in the way. Read. And, act, and what? And act. The most I say, ask. We're not asking. We don't ask no question. All we, do, we don't like these old time ways. But the old time ways on how to, what had us what? Standing here today. The ways of our poor parents. Standing firm in what they believe. How us standing here today. But you know what? We want to put it away. We don't want to be like the old people. But these are the, the, the fundamentals that have us here. That have us strong. That build nation. That build society. That place, place us to the top. So we have to what? And ask for the old path. We have to ask for the old path. What's the old path? The Bible. All people don't believe the Bible. So we have to ask for these paths. Read. Where is the good way? Where is the what? The good way. Where is the laws of God? Because they say it's not away with. That way there is so much wars. There is so much crime among our people. There is prostitution among our people. Watch how the people who or young women dress like harlots in the streets. They don't have respect for themselves. That is the thing we're supposed to be teaching our children. How to conduct themselves. But we're not doing that anymore. Look at us. Look at us. We are a dilapidated people. We don't have respect for each other. Read. Where is the good way? Where is the what? The good way. Nobody wants to keep the commandments of God anymore. They want to teach us in the church that God's laws don't have women. But God's law stands forever. That's right. That's what we have to do. That's what we have to learn. That's what we have to know. Because a society with those laws is what? It becomes a state of crime. Crime. So in God's Bible, there is laws that keep us. There is laws that we should follow. But we're not following it. That's what we're broken as a people. That's what we should finish with it. Come on. And walk there in. And what was I said? And walk there And that's who we're supposed to walk in. The most I ways. Isaiah 34, 16. We have to read out of God's word. That is how we're going to know who we are. Apply God's laws to ourselves. He says, you know you are Israelites according to the Bible? You know you are Israelites? God say we're supposed to keep his commandments. Open up the Sabbath. All these things. God say we have to do. Read. The book of Isaiah 34, verse 16. Read. Seeking out of the book of the Lord. But are people not seeking out of God's words anymore? What is seeking out of what man tell them? They're observing everything that man tell them. They say they love God, but they don't love God according to the Bible. They love God according to what man say. So what God says? Seek the out we of the have book to read of the Lord. out of the book of the Lord. We have to see what God tell us. Observe what God tell us. But we're not doing this thing. We constantly breaking God's laws. That's why we're in the state of oppression. We are a people oppressed. From 1400 to come up. From slavery. Up to now we are in slavery. And we are oppressed as a people every day. Time for us to wake the hell up, people. We are not Grenadians. We are the children of Israel, according to the Bible. Read. Read. Isaiah 34, verse 16. Read. Seek the oath of the book of the Lord. Because the Bible tells us we are the children of Israel. The Bible tells us that we are only 28. And the person of slavery. The person of slavery is going to be a what? A sign unto us. Brother, don't go, brother. Don't go.
out. Don't go, man. Get the product to your fire. All right, so read. There is a number there. So why is that? Read. Seek it out of the book of the Lord because the and book, read. We got Deuteronomy 28, 15, 16. Show us the sign of slavery. It's going to be upon the children of Israel. The sign of slavery happened to us as a people. It happened to no other rest of people. That's right. No other rest of people. The white man you never had yoked up iron around the neck. The white man what? The so-called Jews. They never went into slavery with you. God said it would happen to the children of Israel. And it happened to them. Sis, God said you are Israelites according to the Bible. God said you're cursed, you're slave them, you're to them. The issue of slavery was what they have happened to you and slavery. It was prophesied of you. All people don't want to hear. All people don't want to hear the truth. Yeah, yeah, All people yeah, right. want to walk by. Hey, yeah, but I'm sure it's all people up on the side here. Everybody flocks to that in here. Because why? We love wickedness. God say our people love wickedness. They love to do evil. That happens to our people. Read. Isaiah chapter 4, verse 16. This is what he's showing our people. Now we are the angel like the Bible. Right? Read. So we want to just go to some scripture. No? I'm dying to come here. You know, you have to get the attention of the people. Read. Isaiah chapter 4, verse 16. Read. Seek the out of the book of the Lord and read. We have to seek out of the book of the Most High. He says, one minute at a time, please. You know you are Israelite according to the Bible? Oh. God called you an Israelite. Sis, bro.
nation is you. And finally, my brothers, be strong in the Lord. His word, his word.